The IDPC was asked to help contribute to this training of four regions um, throughout uh, Central Asia towards the UNGAS review and the meeting of the Commission of Narcotic Drugs next March. In 1998, the world community came together and made a bid for a drug-free world. За 10 лет у нас существенно увеличилось более чем в два раза количество наркозависимых людей в Украине, количество людей, которые за данные преступления находятся в местах лишения свободы. They're quite different each region. We've been talking about Georgia, Albania, Ukraine and Kyrgyzstan. It's important um, that people in these regions are given as much information as they can be with a view to enabling them to contribute to what is happening at the international level because what happens at the international level affects what happens in the ground in these regions and in all the regions around the world. The major themes which are relevant to the next CND uh, that we've seen being argued in the meetings so far, the themes of human rights, an observance of human rights by member states when they're implementing drug policy control. А репрессивная наркополитика, существующая, которая как бы закладывалась в Украине в 95 95-м году, она не привела к каким-то существенным изменениям. Соответственно, уровень распространения ВИЧ-спида в Украине растёт, тюрьмы наши превратились просто в инкубатор. A balance between supply reduction measures, harm reduction measures and dealing with the negative unintended consequences of drug control. Uh, как бы не обратить внимание и не реагировать на эти проблемы наше uh, государство, наше правительство, руководство страны не могло. И только, uh, только лишь благодаря uh, внедрению подходов, снижению вреда uh, профилактических программ, направленных на уязвимые группы uh, заместительной терапии, возможно решить эти проблемы и наше правительство и руководство оно уже это понимает. Proportionality that um, what action is taken is appropriate to the harm or the uh, situation that's being responded to. So that links in with other themes like incarceration. Uh, we have very strict drug legislation in Georgia. In 2006 administrative fines were raised. Uh, as well uh, we have imprisonment uh, on drug use, uh, uh, not only possession but drug use. Uh, and there are uh, a lot of people uh, sitting in prison for only <coughs> being using drugs. Also we have a practice of random drug testing. In 2007 uh, 57,000 people were tested and only 20,000 of them uh, turned out to be positive on drug use. In 2007, only uh, 250,000 Georgian lorries were uh, allocated for drug treatment, uh, while from fines uh, and uh, procedural deals, uh, 30 million Georgian lorries were submitted to Georgian budget. Whilst in prison, there are not it's not the environment to better look after the health of these people and to, to preserve against their rights. And so that's a main theme as well that's being played out at the highest levels. Similar themes are the themes of system-wide cohesion. The United Nations bodies, the health bodies, the human rights bodies, and the drug control bodies need to speak with one voice on these issues and need to draw on each other's expertise to create a joined up policy for drug control that ensures the human rights of citizens in all member states. This year, um, coming forward, we are uh, in a stage where the international community is going to decide its approach on drug policy for the next period of time. And so everything is up for grabs at the moment. Everything is to play for. And it's important that these regions are able to bring the interests of their citizens to the tables at the international level. 
Я считаю, что участие гражданского общества в наркополитике, формировании наркополитики и в участии в СНД или комиссии по контролю наркотических средств является очень важным моментом. Yes, about the CND process you know, during the last 10 years and the next meeting in Vienna, we had a very positive, let's say, positive experience based on the 2005 UN Gaza Declaration on HIV AIDS, where two members from the from the NGOs who are part of the delegation. Hopefully some of these regions will be able to include NGO experts on their national delegations to the meetings of the UNGAS review. NGO experts can add real value in terms of experience, expertise and knowledge to inform the debate at the international level.